Hello everyone, this is Lokahol, and in today's video we're going to be making a cold SST helmet. I know I've been doing a bunch of cold SST things, but well, that's what I'm playing, and I'm going to make upgrades for that. So, first off, this is the kind of thing that we are looking for. I'm mainly looking for the nearby enemies have minus 9 to cold resistance. That's a pretty big damage upgrade, and then resistances and life and i'm not going for perfect here i'm just going for something better than this this one i have currently is all right i mean the suffixes are pretty good but i want to get something better so i'm starting off with an item level 86 lion pelt with the redeemer influence if you want to do this yourself i think you only need item level 85 to hit the minus nine and then of course what is also really important is that enchant the spectral shield throw fires five additional shard projectiles to do this we are going to be using just a simple pristine and frigid fossil pristine gives us more life and no defense modifiers and frigid gives us more cold and no fire modifiers so that's going to increase our odds of getting life and the minus nine we've got about 100 chances at this let's get going and see what we can get Ooh, reduced reservation would actually be nice if we get that with the minus nine. It's not going to happen. What do we have here? All right, we hit life, power charger and kill, and minus nine. Uh, <laughs> but that's tier nine life. We've got a lot more chances. I don't actually need power chargers because I'm crit capped, crit chance capped. No minus nine. That would be nice. Fist Taken as Cold is also a... It's a decent mod. I wouldn't complain if I hit that with the minus nine. But from my experience, I see the minus nine once every... 10 attempts or so. Plus three. Oh, man. Just need something like that, but maybe a little bit... A little bit better. Not seeing that minus nine anywhere. All right, there we go. But it's tier seven life, tier six. Yeah, that's that's worse than what we had. 94 life, tier one life, but no minus nine. No minus nine. Oh man, oh man, oh, that would have been so good. That would have been so good if that dex was instead the minus nine, it would have been a sick helmet. Accuracy is definitely one of the best suffixes I could get. It would allow me to unspec some stuff. Damn. That was super close. Another, oh, okay, tier one reservation. Huh. Okay. I wouldn't complain if I hit that suffix. It's not really amazing, but you know. Still no minus nine. Oh, I feel like they made it so rare. Oy vey. We've seen it maybe, what, three times? Oh, okay. I mean, this is pretty all right. What can we get as another prefix? We can get flat life. Not bad. We could get projectiles pierce an additional target. Chance to dodge attack hits. But in the meantime, I think what I'm going to do is get a, a belt and then maybe just use this to try and get a belt with life and cold damage. So I'll be right back. See you in just a second. We got our Stygian Vise. The main thing I'm looking for this is life and cold damage and resistances. Technically, I also would want elemental damage with attack skills like this. So I should be using maybe a three socket resonator and prismatic, frigid and pristine. But I've got all of these. I have all of these sitting here. So let me fill these up. And actually, while I'm here, let me show you a pro tip. If you put your left click on the scroll wheel, you can 
loads your fossils really quickly. It's probably easier if you don't have high ping, but you can do this. Deal. Deal. It's much easier than clicking. Just hold down shift and set your mouse scroll up or whatever to left click. I'm going to fill these up and then we're going to hit this belt and see how much money we waste. Before we get started, I'm going to put on some elemental damage quality with a turbulent catalyst. And I guess now all we need to do is hit it and see what we get. I I honestly do not have very high hopes for this. <laughs> this is a cold damage, no life. I feel like adding prismatic would have been the smart thing to do. That's actually... Remove freeze and chill when you use a flask is actually a really nice suffix because it frees up a slot on your flask, so that could have been better, but we'll see. Nothing too special. Whoa. Oh, wait. Hold on. Oh, wait. Okay. We have... Oh, no, no, no. I thought that 36% was wed, but... 30... Wow. These prefixes are really good. Life, cold damage, increased damage with hits against chilled enemies. I'm always chilling enemies. But... That doesn't count as an elemental mod. Do I... Do I do this? Don't judge me. If I can hit... Just any suffix. I quite like the strength, but... The regen and the sudden block recovery suck. All right. Well, this is a little bit better than this. I suppose this does have much better resistances, but the wed on this is kind of bad. And this essentially has like tier one wed, I guess. This this is like a really bad craft. <laughs> this is, you know what? I'm not happy with this belt. I'm not happy. This is not good enough. We're going to keep going. 24 projectile attack damage, that's pretty nice. I mean, my current belt is alright, so I don't really mind if we don't hit the absolute nuts. I've got a backup. Ooh, that's... Alright. I mean, we could craft wed on this, and it'd be a decent little belt, but... That's tier 3 cold. Like I said... We've got a backup belt, so we're going to keep hitting this one. Life. That remove freeze and chill. I really hope we can get that suffix. What else have we got? 21 cold damage. I think that's also tier 3. Still nothing. Ooh, there we got wed life and resistances. This is like a perfect belt with <laughs> the worst tiers. So, man, if those were all much higher tier, I'd be super stoked. But yeah, no luck. Cold damage, no life. Yep. Yep. Just a few more left. Regret starting to set in. We still have two more. We have one more. And we have another four with cold modifiers. Nothing. That's really... Damn, man. Ah. Oh. Whew, that's a belt, man. That is a real belt. Cold damage, tier two. Tier two, wed. Flask, mana, recovery rate sucks. Do I do it for the content? I, I have to hit it with an annul, right? If I get rid of the flask mana, recovery rate, cool, can craft life. If I get rid of the enemy threshold, cool, I can craft a resistance. If I hit the cold damage or the wed, it's, it's bricked instantly. So if I hit one of those, video is going to instantly end. Have a great day, everyone. Stay safe and don't waste your annuls. Oh! Okay. Well, who needs life? I'm playing... I am playing softcore. Cool, we have a new belt and it adds a bunch of damage.
Very nice. Let's see. 9... 964? And with this old belt... 927. So this is a solid upgrade. Wow. I am uh, pretty surprised. And also our resistances are almost right. Obviously I will add a proper resistance on here and that'll cap our fire res. But yeah, I'm I'm not too unhappy with this and I'm glad I, I came back. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, folks, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video where we'll be doing something I'm not totally sure yet. Maybe something to do with gambling. I don't know. Definitely not going to chase a headhunter with Gwenon. Definitely not that. All right. See you folks next week. Have a wonderful day. Take care. Bye-bye. Exile. You're making me nervous.